one of the great terrible challenges with, with appropriate Lyme diagnosis is that um, Lyme is a spirochete, which means it looks like a corkscrew. And corkscrew bacteria can, can dig their way into any tissue. And so um, it can hide in these pockets. Part of the tissues that it can hide in are tissues that don't get very good immune um, activation or immune support. Um, and so that's one of the ways that it can evade the immune system and therefore evade testing and detection. Um, but they are also sneaky in twofold other ways. So one of the ways that Lyme is sneaky is that it makes immune complexes, which means it basically finds the lock and the key so that when you're looking for the lock, which would be the, the antibody to the antigen, um, our, our body, our immune system is blocked from making that properly because the bacteria itself creates the immune complex. And so it's hard to detect uh, the, the antibodies to the Lyme. Um, the other way that Lyme is sneaky is that it, it actually infects the immune system itself. And so uh, natural killer cells, which are usually used to, to identify and kill bacteria, um, get infected and their numbers go down quite significantly. Um, and other lymphoid cells as well are, are greatly affected. And so that also has a big impact on testing that is largely immune-based.